Hello and welcome to the Quick Schools Parent Messaging Module Quick Guide. The Parent Messaging Module is a powerful tool that simplifies the process of sending messages to parents, teachers, and students via email, text messages, or phone calls. In this video, we'll be showing you how to activate and configure the Parent Messaging Module, how to compose and send out email and text messages, demonstrate how to record and send voice messages, then create custom lists of recipients to simplify the process of sending messages. To get started, let's go to the Features page and activate and configure the Parent Messaging Module. Check the checkbox in the Parent Messaging row to activate the feature, and then click Configure to set it up. Type in or select the users you want to grant access to to send messages to parents. Then select who can run reports. And finally, make sure that the correct country code is selected for your location. Right now it is set to plus one, which is the country code for sending text and voice messages within the United States. When finished, click Save. Now let's go to the Parent Messaging page by clicking the tab in the top menu. The Parent Messaging homepage is divided into four sections, Email, Text Message, Voice Message, and Recipient Lists. Let's start by sending out a mass email message. The first thing you will want to address is whom the email will be sent from. By default, the email will be sent from your email address. To use a different email, click the change link and enter in the new name and email you would like the message to be from. Next, select the student of the parents you wish to send the email out to by clicking or typing in this field and selecting their name from the drop-down menu. You also have the option to send out the email to the entire school by selecting all students from the drop-down list. Parents can specify whether to receive emails or not from the school, but in some cases, like an emergency situation, you may need to override that option and you can do so by clicking this link here. Checking the box will ensure that the message will be sent to the parents regardless of their settings. You can also choose to send an email to teachers, students, or both by selecting these links. Clicking on each link will create a new text field, from which you can then select whom you wish to send the email to. With your email recipients chosen, it's now time to compose your message. Start by entering in the subject of your email, then type in your message. If a message is used frequently, click the Save As Template button to create an email template. This option is particularly helpful when sending out similar messages in the future and can be a big time saver. Lastly, click here if you have any files you wish to attach to your message. When you're finished, click Send Email. Quick Schools gives you one last chance to review your email, and if everything is okay, click Send Email. A detailed record of your email message will now appear at the bottom of the screen in the Email History table, along with all previous emails that have been sent. In the Status column, you can quickly confirm whether your emails were delivered or not. Clicking the View Details link, will open a complete listing of who was sent the email, along with the status of the email's delivery. The text message feature works in a similar way to sending emails. Let's take a look. Again, select the students whose parents will be receiving the text message. You can still choose to directly send the message to students and teachers as well by clicking the same links as before. Type in your message, and when you're finished, send it out by clicking the Send Text Message button. Note that there is a small telecommunications charge associated for each text message sent. A detailed record of your text messages will appear in the text message history table with the status of each text clearly displayed. Now let's dive into the last and most powerful feature, voice messaging. With voice messaging, Quick School simplifies the process of recording and sending out an automated message to your school's parents. No extra equipment is needed, just Quick Schools and your phone. To get started, let's record your voice message by clicking here. Give your message a name and then enter in the phone number you want Quick Schools to call. Click the Call Me Now button and Quick Schools will call your phone to record your message. And there's Quick Schools now. Please record your message after the beep. Hello, this is a message to the parents of Greenville Elementary. Due to the damage from the recent storm, school will be closed tomorrow. For further updates, check the school website. Thank you. It's that easy. Instantly, the system recognizes that the message has been recorded and is saved into a list of all your pre-recorded voice messages. 
Notice that Quick Schools will also automatically transcribe your message for you. Now let's use this recording by selecting the Use Recording link. Note that you can see that the message has been selected. Choose who you want the message to be sent to from the drop-down, and finally, click the Call Phones button to send out the voice message. All the list of parents will be called, and your message will be played back to them. Again, be aware that there is a small telecommunications charge applied for each voice message sent. If your school wants to send messages to specific groups like clubs or school committees, then the Recipient Lists section can help. Here you can make customized lists of any of the contacts in your system, then organize them by specific names, making it super simple to send messages to groups. To create a new list, simply click the Add Call List button. Now enter in a name for your list, and select the grades and or students of the parents you wish to add to the list. When finished, click Save. Your list is created and can now be selected in the drop-down menu for all the messaging options. We hope you enjoyed this chapter of our quick guide. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact us by either using the live chat bubble in the bottom right of your screen or emailing us at support at quickschools.com.